Hey Shimani, today I'm going to be talking about the new Pokemon Scarlet and Violet trailer that just came out recently. So very interesting about this trailer is, uh, depending on each, uh, you know, which game you choose, uh, you actually get a different professor. And we also get to see the starters in their 3D models. Honestly, I honestly think that I might either choose Sprigatito or Fue Coco. Like, I, I mean, I'm not entirely sure, I'm not a big fan of Quaxly. Um, honestly, like, I mean, Spr I like cats, Sprig of Dito is interesting, but Fue Coco, Fue Coco is a pretty interesting and cool design. You know what, it depends on, um, what, uh, evolutions, uh, they turn into. Then, some new Pokemon get revealed. This one looks to be the Rodent. This one looks to be a Grass or Bug type. It's interesting. And this one, uh, this one looks like a pig. It might either be a normal type or a ground type, but I'm not entirely sure. Another very promising part about this game is the fact that it's fully open world. Pokemon Legends Arceus did have open world, but not to the extent that uh, this game is promising. Oh yeah, by the way, gyms are actually back now. And then the legendaries actually get revealed. They actually look really good. I'm actually, I actually really like their designs, they look actually pretty cool. So, the one that is red is a dragon and fighting type, and it's, uh, it's themed it, about, like, you know, the past. I mean, I'm guessing Scar, Pokemon Scarlet is about, like, researching the past or something like that, and then, um, the, uh, Violet is something about the future or something. Because, uh, the Pokemon on the right is about, like, you know, the future, you know what I mean. Oh yeah, speaking of the other one, uh, the, uh, futuristic one is, uh, probably Dragon and Electric type. And, uh, yeah, those were my overall thoughts about this trailer. I think it's actually really good. And, uh, yeah, guys, make sure to like and subscribe, and bye!